Astronomers have discovered in a rare and fascinating case of a black hole binary, or a pair of black holes orbiting each other that are so massive that they refuse to collide and merge. This pair is located in a collision-created fossil galaxy, and it consists of the heaviest black hole pair ever seen, with a combined mass of 15 billion times the Sun. They are also the closest black hole pair ever spotted, at just 24 light years apart, which is about the distance from the Sun to the nearest star. This discovery has huge implications for our understanding of how supermassive black hole mergers are formed and observed, and why they are so elusive and hard to detect. In this video, we will explore the details of this discovery, how astronomers got these results, why this is so important, and what we can learn from it. So if you're curious, then keep watching. The first thing we need to know about this black hole pair is how they were discovered and measured. The astronomers who made this discovery used a technique called Very Long Baseline Interferometry, or VLBI, which combines the signals from multiple radio telescopes across the world to create a virtual telescope as big as the Earth. This technique allows them to achieve very high resolution and sensitivity and to observe the radio waves emitted by the black holes and their surroundings. Using VLBI, the astronomers were able to measure the mass, distance, and orbital period of the black hole pair. They found that the black holes have masses of 9.5 billion and 5.5 billion times the Sun, respectively, making them the heaviest black hole pair ever seen. They also found that they are separated by only 24 light years, which is about the distance from the sun to the nearest star. This makes them the closest black hole pair ever spotted and also the slowest, as they take about 30,000 years to complete one orbit around each other. These numbers are astonishing and they raise some interesting questions. How did these black holes get so massive and close? What are the effects of their gravity on their environment? And why haven't they merged yet? Supermassive black hole mergers are predicted by the theory of general relativity, which describes how gravity affects space and time. According to this theory, when two black holes merge, they produce powerful gravitational waves, which are ripples in the fabric of space and time that travel across the universe. These waves carry information about the mass, spin, and location of the merging black holes, and they can be detected by special instruments on Earth such as the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, or LIGO. However, despite the theoretical predictions, supermassive black hole mergers have never been observed in progress. This is because they are very rare and difficult to catch, as they require very specific conditions and timescales. For example, the black holes need to be close enough to each other to overcome their mutual repulsion and spiral inwards but not too close to be obscured by dust and gas. They also need to be in a relatively quiet and isolated environment where they are not disturbed by other stars or galaxies, and they need to be within the observable range of our instruments, which are limited by the sensitivity and frequency of the gravitational waves they can detect. This is where this black hole pair comes in. This pair is a unique and valuable case study for testing and improving our models and methods of supermassive black hole mergers. For one thing, they are in a very special environment, a collision-created fossil galaxy that is the result of a merger between two massive galaxies in the distant past. This galaxy is very old and inactive, with little star formation or gas, and it hosts only one pair of black holes unlike most galaxies that have multiple pairs. This makes it a perfect laboratory for studying the effects of the black hole gravity on the surrounding space and matter, and for measuring their properties with high precision and accuracy. For another thing, they are in a very interesting stage of their evolution, where they are massive enough and close enough to each other to be considered as a potential merger candidate, but not so close that they are expected to merge anytime soon. This means that they are in a stable and long-lasting orbit, where they can be monitored and observed for a long time, and where they can provide clues about the factors and mechanisms that prevent or delay their merger. For example, one possible factor is their massive size, which could create a strong gravitational recoil that pushes them apart when they merge. Another possible factor is their long orbital history, which could make them lose angular momentum and energy 
through gravitational radiation and interactions with their environment. This discovery is important because it sheds new light on one of the most fundamental and fascinating questions in astrophysics and cosmology. How do supermassive black holes form and evolve, and how do they influence the structure and evolution of the universe? Supermassive black holes are the most extreme and mysterious objects in the universe, and they play a crucial role in shaping the history and destiny of the cosmos. They are the seeds of galaxy formation and evolution, as they grow by merging with other black holes and consuming matter and energy. They are also the sources of powerful jets and radiation, which can affect the formation and evolution of stars, planets, and life. Moreover, they are the probes of gravity and space-time, as they test the limits and predictions of the theory of general relativity, and reveal the nature and origin of the gravitational waves that ripple across the universe. By discovering and studying this black hole pair, the astronomers have made a significant contribution to our understanding of these cosmic monsters and have opened new avenues and opportunities for further exploration and discovery. They have also faced and overcome some major challenges and difficulties, such as the technical and computational limitations of the VLBI technique, the complexity and uncertainty of the data analysis and interpretation, and the rarity and elusiveness of the phenomenon they are investigating. However, there are still many challenges and mysteries that remain to be solved and explained. For example, how did these black holes get so massive and close in the first place? What are the exact mechanisms and timescales of their merger process? How will their merger affect their galaxy and the surrounding space? And how can we detect and observe their merger and the gravitational waves they produce? These are some of the questions that the astronomers hope to answer in the future by continuing to observe and monitor this black hole pair, by improving and expanding their VLBI technique and network, by collaborating and comparing with other instruments and methods, and by searching and finding more examples of similar pairs in other galaxies. We hope you enjoyed this video and that you learned something new and interesting about these cosmic monsters and their secrets. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more videos about the latest news and discoveries in astronomy and space science.